Connor, what you think about our, our band? Why don't you tell him what you think? Trash. About? <laughs> <laughs> He's honest. I have to, I have to bring them down so that way they can only do better from there. I love set it off. Always have. Always will. Hi. I'm very upset. Um, you can tell I'm a massive Philadelphia Eagles fan, and their biggest nemesis are the Dallas Cowboys. Well, last year, uh, during the season, I was confident that we were going to end the season with more wins than the Dallas Cowboys for the 2016-2017 season. The bet was, if I lost, that I would have to wear a Dallas Cowboys jersey on stage. I lost that bet. My friend Cameron brought this for me. I have to wear this stupid jersey, Des Bryant, on stage tonight. I'm not happy about it. So all my friends, please just know, I'm not a fan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah! What's poppin' SIO fam? What's good? What's good? We got a lot of cool stuff happening real soon. I just spit on you. Yo, yo, do me a favor. Check out that merch link in bio! Yo, be a, be a diamond. Be a diamond. So I recently just did a poll on my Twitter of whether or not I should shave this beard. I did keep beard, shave beard, trim the stubble. And uh, someone with the handle at Dick Guzzler says, I see your three options and raise you a fourth. Shave half of it. But she thought I wouldn't do it. Guess again. <laughs> well, that lasted about 10 seconds. <laughs> All right, these will be for sale for five bucks a pop, five bucks a hair. So uh, if you want, oh, it's really gross. I don't recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> right now we are at Alternative Press headquarters because we're gonna be doing a couple interviews this morning, so let's head on in. Hey, Hello. how are you doing? What's up? Hey. Great, how are you? Well, you see all the uh, a lot of artists basically when they come here. Design, design this giant. Oh, there we are. Oh, there we are. Frankie. Right next to me. <laughs> right next to my eighth grade. How did you do it? I don't know. Wow, that is a gross thing. Oh wow. Someone just tweeted me this photo of their dad. He's just meditating with his cat under blue lights. I love that. Yeah. <laughs> Do I look like an owl? <laughs> um, somebody paid you a million dollars and you have to practice the bit you've never practiced before in front of all of these people. What key? What <laughs> key is it from? Is this a G chord? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. You're gonna love this. I'm excited. All over the place. At any point. Hold for slurp. I almost choked on that one. <laughs> oh. Give me a dance. Come on. A little dance? Alright, here we go. Dance. Here it comes. Here it comes. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. It's coming. Uh, <laughs> yep. Are you whipping at me? Yeah. Good. Two and a half years late. I know. I'm gonna do it. Oh, here it comes. Is that a doing it? A weird picture request. Are we doing a picture or a video? Video. Alright, it's my friend Miguel. He's like super cool or whatever. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is nothing. <laughs> Never seen this happen before. <laughs> Super Bowl, baby! <laughs> That's how you win. That's how you win. <laughs> I'm you, 
but I'm not you. <laughs> yeah, sugar's being used as a metaphor for love making. Cause that's all they talked about in 80s hair metal was sexual intercourse. It's a euphemism, if you will. But you can't explain that in a song because it would take away from from the magic of it. Sugar. Sugar. You're just trying to darken up the verse right now. Yeah. Okay, I see what you're saying. Caffeinated coffee tastes like shitty hot chocolate. So now that you guys are in LA, um, is it, do you guys like have a van to get to shows or how does that work? Uh, it's actually quite tricky. Um, we don't own a van or trailer anymore. I mean, most most touring we do is either in a bandwagon or uh, a bus. We just played a show for IW Radio recently called Fishmas. Um, and we had to rent a U-Haul, kind of figure out how to get all of our gear there, carry gear up a of stairs, like didn't have any crew. So it was really cool to, it was kind of really cool to get back down to our roots and figure that part out as well. But it was also a living nightmare. <laughs> It just doesn't make sense to rent a whole bus and vehicle for for one day. Oh god, no. Yeah, for for, for one for one. It's either that or just have a trailer and a van, but only for local shows, and that's more of an expense than just getting you all for a day. Like it, it just financially doesn't make sense to do that. Yeah, you can all get around. That's a good thing about having friends around, and we all we all can drive ourselves knows. to shows. Yeah, it is, it's uh, it's a very local effort, I guess you could say. Yeah. I am. Today, Papa's getting his musical fix in today. Anytime you guys need another tech on stage, you know your boy's got you. I don't even know how to put this on. Right? Is this, am I doing this right? We're gonna need you to check every instrument. Thank you. You did, basically. The Pretty drums. much. Yeah, drums, yeah, guitars, drums. vocals, sax. Oh my god. Oh. Is that right? Did I do that right? I did not know you knew how to play sax. I don't. I didn't know I knew how to play sax. <laughs> you nailed it. <laughs> Sounded good. Sounded the best it's ever sounded. <laughs> I only know two notes, man. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Fuck yeah. yeah. I think so. Do we? No. Leave the bar. Me. Alone. Sorry, Bay. Just trying to help. She called me Bay. <laughs> hey Siri, rap for me. Okay. I said a hip hop. Save me from the clippy. The peak. Peak and pop. And you don't stop. Space record. She's really bad at that. <laughs> <laughs> that is the worst rap that I have ever heard, and I've listened to Vanilla Ice. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta stretch your face, but nah! There's the thing from Jurassic Park. Yes! Let me do a little bit there. Well, what I'm gonna go with right now is I'm gonna get myself a half chicken, lemon and herb, with uh, some grilled mashed potatoes, and I'm deciding on my second side right now, so back off, okay? <laughs> I am um, actually gonna get a portobello mushroom, halloumi cheese, and chili jam. Uh, two sides with uh, mashed potatoes and fries. Or maybe I'll do double fries. We don't know yet. Definitely gonna do the lemon and herb. Just back off right now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I heard it twice. Some people don't get that you can. You're just supposed to bleh a melody out. Like that. That like some people don't understand. Like they'll. they'll some people think that you have to do it on a piano or that it just starts with lyrics. And a lot of times it just starts with melody. No, and like I didn't know that for a while. It's it's a feeling. Like you like when Dan's playing guitar and I get excited about it and I know I'm gonna be able to write a good melody to it. I'll just start singing my own, my, what I call dummy lyrics, like so make up words, and it'll make no sense at all. And then, it'll, um, and then it'll turn out into something. Yeah. Then I'll put lyrics to it. I do lyrics last now. It's me! I drove four hours to be here today! Oh, me! Me over here! 
I've been waiting for this moment! Ah! <laughs> we did it! Oh. oh, I lost it in the light. So bring it back again! I got it outside, it upside down. I got it Man. That was a man song. That was a man song. Make a smile out of that frown. Hey, children. <laughs> you want to cook a fucking steak? You want to hear a man sing? <laughs> you want to be men? <laughs> gonna salt down some steak. Quitting smoking like for thank you. Good. I'm just gonna give you. Uh, but I've but oh, I've quit thanks. smoking like <laughs> seven or eight times. Oh oh hi there. What's Yo, up? <laughs> Put it in his laptop. Oh, so they're there. We just pick, pick and choose. I'm trying to do my best way in the Rock Johnson smolder. It is cool. It's so cool how the That's set bandwagon. Is. I love seeing. Can you imagine having it like school? I need a napkin. I'm not gonna help you. No, fuck you. It's so spicy. Everything's making it worse. Charlie, don't you ever do that again? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know, it's, uh, it's about I being a band. Is, hey, I'm John. I'm the new Bobby. Good. And I like it's being a band. It's my passion. It's and good. What's good about being a passion is somebody's passionate somebody about it, man. And you gotta. No, that's not mine. Somebody be behind the bar. You gotta believe in yourself if you're gonna do it. Okay. Is that what it is? Uh, okay. Uh, it